手置きを見せてやる Alright, l so in this one, we are going to be using LF Super g e t o Now, this guy, when he first Zenkai, e d everyone thought and everyone said this is gonna be the best Zenkai in the game. Hopefully, they don't underdo him. Hopefully, he's just beyond belief, insane, broken, number one, back to where he was when he first came out. Obviously, during the first anniversary. And, well, he, he was the best Zenkai in the game. Maybe he wasn't the number one unit in the game because Ultra Gogeta, GV, and all these other units kind of existed. But he was the best Zenkai in the game on his release. Now that time has passed, we've had Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta Zenkai, we've had, you know, normal Zenkais, but primarily Super, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta Zenkai, and it seems like that's surpassed Super Vegeta. Now, just to touch on him and his kit, I don't think they were worried about making him one of the better Zenkais in the game. I think they were, like, confident, like, okay, we're gonna do this for him, give him back his justice that he rightfully deserves from his initial release to where he is now, because he was just dead for years, months, like, he was dead for a good while, right? So they gave him his justice, they made him very usable, very good, but they gave him a pretty big glaring issue, which he's actually had since his initial release, it just wasn't as prominent because back then you could have some issues and be fine. Right now, when you have any flaw in your kit, there is going to be a lot of, like, pushback on that unit individually compared to other units, and Super Vegito does have a flaw. Now his flaw, which, again, was a little bit altered, a little bit helped, is how he gets his damage. Uh, while the characters on Battlefield Flying Fix occur when Arts card is drawn. Now, what this means is he's slowly ramping up, right? He's at 20%, 20%, 20%, 20%, 20%. He get all these, you know, fantastic things. And he has card draw speed, right? They gave him card draw speed on uh, whatever new unique. Yeah, this new unique here, the premise of that being, oh, look, okay, you have a full hand gone. You just did a full hand with G4, Ultra Gogeta. Nice off to your Super Gito, you have card draw speed, you get 20%, 20%, 20%, 20%, 20%, you know, you have, uh, what, 80% build up, probably like a 60-20 on like your strike and blast, and maybe you have like an oddball green card or blue card, you're getting some build up, right, so you have them going and going and going, the issue is that, um, Ultra Gogeta is starting out at like 140, 150%, you have G4 starting out at like 130, 120%, then you have Super Gito who's starting out, just again, starting out, which is the important factor here, at 40%, just base, right? 40%, and then he keeps going up to 30, and then, okay, then I draw new cards, then I do these things, so while he gets going, he's fine, but early game, and your initial come in is what matters, like, you see LFs that start off with 90, 100, 110, and these high-ass percentages, like Cell, like, LF Cell, right? He starts off at, what, 105 or something against, like, a Saiyan, and even more against the hybrid? 105! This is Super Vegito, a new Zenkai who starts at 70, 70, right, 40, 30, and he doesn't get any of this because you look at it here, Falling Facts character, uh, card, card is drawn, and again, this is going to be like, in effect, you know, frame one, but when you actually enter, if you're trying to combo with Super Vegito, you will not have this, I guess you could have one, one buff, because he gets a card when there are three or fewer in his hand, but again, that's his biggest drawback, his slowness. Compare him to Ultra Gogeta or G4 or Full Power Frieza or these top tier units, and, you know, this is meant to be a top tier unit in the game. He's just too slow. And this is, like, <laughs> this is a power creep issue more than anything. You could say the same thing about Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, where he's too slow. But Vegeta, how he goes, he has strike buffs. You know what he wants. He wants strike arts. From his first strike to his second strike, it's like he's getting 100% strike art damage inflicted. I don't know why it feels like that, because he's supporting himself, he's getting more damage inflicted build up as he goes and goes and goes. Similar to Super Gito, without card draw speed, by the way, but his team just feels more cohesive for him. Uh, Super Gito's team is big damage dealer, big damage dealer, Super Gito. While he does support and do these nice things, again, his biggest drawback is his innate slowness on his own, which... You know, there's some teams you just don't see him cord out because of that. Um, on top of, look at the yellows. Like, it's just unfortunate for him. Ultra Kaioken, Full Power Frieza, Future Gohan, like, whoever else comes to mind. You have all these insane yellows, and it's like, they're core on every single team. This guy's purple. What's the point of running him, right? Like, I'd rather, rather run Majub or um, Future Gohan or Ultra Kaioken in, like, a leader slot as spot. And run this guy because of his slowness and his color. He just got screwed over by that. Stat-wise, um, I'm pretty sure he is vibing, though. Honestly, defense could be a little bit higher. For his cut that he has, he doesn't have high cut. Right? He only has 15%. That's the same thing as Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. He has near the same stats Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Honestly, a little bit less on the blast defense. 
and he has the same cut. See? There's some spots you could definitely tell they held back, but they wanted to do him justice as well, which they did. On a mono purple setup, you know, that build-up situation where he's a little bit slow, you don't see it because you have Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta being that crazy support unit. You have Zenkai Bus up the ass. Like, you have a lot of stuff going for him there. But on another setup that's just generic as hell, which is Fusions, right? This is where you're going to run him. It's Fusions. It's fucking his team. That's what his Z ability is. Uh, he's just slower than what you would want with not high cut, with some support capabilities, but nothing insane. And his support capabilities, by the way, his support capabilities are very good here because you look at what he does um where is his support in his kit where is his support hello <laughs> they might okay there it is uh 10 percent damage inflicted by allies 15 target counts when enemy using arts carvels cop battlefield yeah that's cool that's good um i would say that's all right like it's definitely good support but again 15 percent cut it's like can super judo tank no um, maybe after he pops main and cancels their buffs, and, you know, he could maybe tank there, but Super Vegito's not gonna tank some godly units. Obviously, some circumstances, he could just, like, have him eat some hits, obviously, early game and all that, but in a whole situation, it's not perfect, right? There's a lot of imperfections with Super Vegito. Uh, his blue card is a long animation, by the way. Green card is pretty fine. Uh, main ability gives him card draw speed, so how he gets, like, actual going is when he pops his main because you have double card draw speed because he gets to someone entry he'll get a card on entry he'll get a lot of build up going after you pop his main you'll see super look like a different breed of a unit after main and before main right double card draw speed keep going 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 damage afflicted health back key back all these things canceling their attribute upgrades he'll do very well after main but again i do feel like pre-main he does feel like a little bit lackluster in his own damage department where this guy was known for, like, being that damage god, right? And, you know, comparably, it's just power creep at this point. His damage has taken a little bit of a backseat. Uh, Equip-wise, Z-ability-wise, you know, basic fusion, strike attack, defense from Ultra Gogeta, leader slot him because why not? Uh, Super Joe getting HP and strike attack defense, G4 getting double defense, Gotenks HP, Maju is, what, double attack and something else like that. Then uh, Gogeta Blue is double attack there as well. Equipped by Super Gito, I'm pretty sure we're vibing. I'm pretty sure this is the best equip setup for him. Double defense, then pure strike for each fusion war bell member. His own plat, which, Jesus Christ, I need to awaken because blast for a slot. He's a strike based unit. Come on, legends. Um, pure blast for each fusion war bell member. Double defense, pure per fusion war bell member. And then 9.80% uh, to own strike attack for 15 turn counts when change cover. And 50% to his ultimate damage. Then the last one here special damage, strike attack, and base health. With that being said, let's get into the matches and see how the King of Legends, the original King of Legends, to be real, uh, you know, maybe Red Gogeta and the others, but like this guy, this guy was definitely it on his own. Like, that was a Super Saiyan setup where he ran Red Gogeta, DBS Broly, Super Saiyan Bardock. The King, individual King of Legends, Super Vegeta, can do in PvP. First match up against LOE. Who did he bring? Color counter. That's what happened. Not good for me, but I guess we'll deal with it. Let's go to you. Mm -hmm. It's five out. Andrew Golden Frieza being a nuisance back there, increasing my damn cost. Take double PVs though. Please swap here. Green card. We are. We're not actually moving. Are we moving? Well, we'll just swap anyways. Tap here. Tap again. Unfortunate, and I guess we can't get the support build up if nothing else, but you know, it's not the greatest thing <laughs> to just take hits. Swap out. Why would you drop? Sure. We both play silly, I guess. Destroy his whole hand here. Why did he drop? That was purple. Ah, okay, whatever. He <laughs> I destroy his whole hand, draws a blue card. Awesome, awesome. Not even. That RNG, man. That RNG. Crazy. That shit go crazy for people, huh? <laughs> Alright. Well, I can't cover change here, technically. Unfortunately, my, uh... Rush is on this blue card, and my top of two more cards! LOE, huh? LOE. I'm gonna attack instantly. All you out here have double card draw speed. Draw another card. Dropped. Okay. Swap out. 
I'll pop this. Hopefully I get my Russian hand sometime soon. Uh, I've had it before, but I've lost it. He got hit. He got hit. I thought he was going to rush me there. If he rushed me there, he would have caught me. Which, <laughs> I wouldn't be uh, too shocked by Eloi rushing before I get my rush. Goodbye to you. Interesting. Definitely interesting. I'll just go for Blast. You're going to cover here. Yeah. Could have just blue carded. It could have done a million different things, but no need to do all that. Uh, I think you can kind of notice it, though, a little bit. Super Gito's damage comparably to the other two is not as high. Maybe I'm just spewing. I don't know what, what you're doing, but sure. Uh, thank you for the kill. Appreciate that. Maybe I'm just spewing a little bit here, but I saw it there. That ultimate compared to, let's say, what Super Gito's ultimate would have done if it were, you know, a neutral thing. Probably wouldn't have done as much, given, you know, Zenkai Freeze is definitely tanky. Did we hit a god rank? We did. Okay. I'll just get the animation. We'll probably get our sleeves this season, right? Because I'm that number 9. I'll be at number 10 after this season. How many seasons have there been? 11? Uh, including this one? Yeah, it's been 11 seasons. Eh, not bad. Um, overall, though, I do see his damage already. Like, first match, it's a little bit lacking to what I would hope, comparably to other units. Again, I'm comparing him to the other units because this guy... I mean, he's Super Vegito. You would think he's like a Z-tier uh, god beyond belief, but in reality, I could see an argument where even GV is probably you know equivalent to Super Vegito, and I think GV have fallen down quite a bit to where they're barely even top 10, and I think Super Vegito could actually be below that, especially when he's only runnable on one team. At least GV had the tag mechanic, and they're runnable on several. I'm really saying God King Mono Purple, and Mono Purple, I'm giving like some air quotes here. Um... Just because how color countered it is by all these greens and yellows that are crazy right now. Super Gito is run on less teams. On top of he's not even core on this one. GV you can force to be core if you build around them. Let's just keep going. Fusions. Against fusions. Okay. Majub here, I believe. Which, I don't know, Super Gito. Getting hurt by that one. Go for your green card, my friend. Woo! Never tell that was gonna happen. Let's drop. Cool. I'll go Super Vegito. Oh. A million more HP at least. Okay. And we lose some. 800k. Okay. Alright. I mean, Super Vegito should do well here. I'm gonna spam click just because he has uh, no one to swap to. Can we do 2.6 million? We're not getting buffs because we're not drawing cards or anything. I don't know the stars on that Super Vegito. I'll be real. If I knew, I could gauge that better, but I don't know. Keep trying for the green card, man. Honestly, it's kind of funny to watch you try for it. Swap? Nah. I say it, but then I don't actually expect it. It's like, you know, just a silly thing going on there. Cool. Sidestepping, I heard you. All right. Love to go, Super Vegito. Let's get you built up. I mean, you should be able to kill somebody in this combo. I'll be really realistic here. You should easily be able to kill somebody in this combo. I don't know if we kill Maju. Again, the yellows that just exist. Even Majub's not even that great. Like, honestly, Majub's just a green card spammer. Nah, I'm not killing fucking Majub's either. It's like... Oh, man. It hurts. It hurts. His damage is so low on his entrance. And it's like... Man. Like, even G4 there. G4 had no cut. It was just raw G4, green to purple. And it's like, G4 is half HP. Not even half HP right now. It's like, come on. Like, come on. You gotta give me some fucking help here. My unit just can't kill there. Like, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. His damage just always feel like it's underwhelming to an extent. Okay. Can I mean we'll, we'll kill on this surely if we can. If we can do it. Hello. Hello. <gasps> kill here. Thankfully, that card draw speed by the way, it's like 20 time recounts for his main ability, which is again very nice. After main again, Super Joe can look like a different beast. Because he's going and going and going and going. Kind of like Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta can go and go and go with his at double card draw speed as well. On his main ability. But, um... Seeing that there, it's like... Oh. I just hope for more. I, I, I really don't know what else to say. I would hope for Super Vegeta to get more damage. More than, you know, a little bit of cut. A little bit of support. A little bit of this. Like... Just give my man's damage, right? That's what he wants, and yet yeah, we couldn't. <sighs> Let's keep going. Well, 
Let's see how we do here. What is what is the team? Godkey? I wasn't uh, looking. Godkey, okay. The lead with GV. Interesting. Okay. Just vibe out here. Get advantage back there. Probably didn't expect it. Uh, we'll go for a blast because Mr. Ultra. Probably gonna stay in, huh? Just so you could get your uh, situation for. Oh, okay. Or not. Let's go here. It's not gonna do any damage on this, but it's alright. Didn't go Super Gito just because it's pretty obvious that uh, if I do, that I would get color countered out in the spot. I'm trying to tap here. Double green cards, huh? Okay. Dark my strike was quick. Well, get fucked over by that. Okay, not good. Let me go for blast because I have Ultra Gogeta there. Call you out. Got a Russian hand at least, which is nice. And my Russian hand is gone. I did it too early to sidestep. Cool. Thankfully that worked out. Blue card. Probably a blue card here, right? No? Okay. I mean, we will kill on a rush. You know, I can shit talk Super Vito's damage all I want. We will kill on a rush. Okay. Are you scared of a rush? Does Vegeta live this? He does go neutral. Doesn't even try it. Really didn't try it? Really? I feel like Vegeta actually could have lived that. I don't have... Uh, low HP, so I'm not doing, like, you know, a fuck ton of damage on Rush. Okay. Interesting sack off GV there. It, again, kind of goes to show, Super Saiyan Blue, Vegeta, and Ultra Kyle Ken probably are better than GV. Uh, you know, unfortunate for them. Pop it just to pop it. He's neutral for a little bit here. I'll just go. Tap. Yeah. I don't think you could swap. This should do a lot. You're not neutral. See, uh, man, that's a green, man. He wasn't neutral either. That's what I'm talking about. That's why I don't like it, man. That's a green. I'm purple. My green, uh, my purple should not be struggling against that, man. I don't know. I can't, uh, I can't vouch for Super Vegeta when I see that. That's him with a lot of buildup. Like, a fuck ton of buildup there. A raw damn blue card. Can't kill? Like, ugh. It's disheartening, honestly. It's like, how? Ah, oh, didn't, didn't pop me in there, whatever. Caught him, thankfully, because this guy would have been a fucking problem. Let's go for a blast here. Okay, cool. You're not gonna pop me in. Now you might. Cool. You wanna kill him? Kill him. <laughs> I'm tired of him as well, so you can just fucking have him. <laughs> now you're tapping. He wanted to get the rush off. I get it, I get it. He wanted to get the rush off right there to kill Super Vegito. But, dude, that that is a purple to a green! Like, I can't... I, I know I say things and they might seem like, oh my god, like, he really said Super Vegito's damage is lacking. Like, really? Like, but dude, they're... Like, I have pink equips for the guy. I have blue card equips on him, for fuck's sake. Like, I can't, I can't do more. I have literally the best setup for him. 14 stars on his normal team, and he's still struggling. It's like... I, I'm sorry that he's aged out, like, not aged out, but, like, uh, gotten, I guess, power crap to an extent, because th that's a green! That's a green off cover! Like, I don't know, like, what do I say? <laughs> His damage is just so slow for that. What do you even have there? He had, like, uh, I had popped main. I had extra damage. I had at least 100%. Then blue card gives, like, 30% on activation or some shit like that. I must have had, like, uh, over, like, 150, 170%. It doesn't even kill fucking Vegeta. It did a lot. But, like, dude, I, I had done cards. I had gotten hit. Like, I, I had build up. I had stuff going. And he still couldn't kill Vegeta there? That's a purple to a green. That That's. That's where I say GV is probably better because that shit. That shit doesn't fly. It doesn't. Because you can't have that in 2022. You have units that are one combo, you that are disadvantaged. You have Ultra Kaioken doing like 70% of CMZ's health in one combo. And it's like. What the fuck's going on there? Super Vito can't even kill a fucking green on a blue card when he has no cut, no neutral, and it's like... What the, I get, I get it, like, Vegeta's tanky, but he only has, like, 20% cut off cover! It's like, he's not that tanky! <laughs> and we 
always struggle with a peaked out Super Vegito. It's like, mm, man, like how else can I help? He has blue card damage up because of Ultra Gogeta. On top of the equip, he has that from him. <laughs> and he struggled. He struggled. He didn't fucking kill. <sighs> He's too damn slow. Take off the regen thing, by the way. 30% strike damage to regen. Just make that fucking overall damage afflicted. Whatever. Like, why? Who the fuck? Regen. Yeah, regen's running around. Like, who, who, not even when he dropped regen was running around. What the hell was that for? I get it for, like, when he first dropped. Oh, my God. Buhan. Scary man. You know, purple beats green, by the way. Because Buhan was fucking green. The first anniversary one. It's like, make him unrestricted. You, ah, uh, the whole back. The whole back. He has, like, a chokehold around him, Super Vegito. Because the whole back, you just feel it. You feel it right there. That's so disappointing. Let's keep trying, but that, that, that gets me. Because it's like, you, you could have made him so much better than that right there. And that right there is upsetting. Uh, is this future going on fusions? Because, you know, it's a better situation than using Super Vegito. It is. Okay. I win this. We win it. I'll just go G4 and throw this, I guess, because, you know, he's free. Take this. Quite a bit. PB? No. Hmm. I thought he would uh, go instantly there. Call you out. Okay, well. Future Gohan's not tanky. Might swap here. To Ultra. Not ultra. Okay. It's fine. Won't do much. Cool. Um, we have a lot of build up here. Super Gito should do well here. Thought I'd do one more than cover, but okay. Just can't stay in there. Nothing I can do. Unfortunate that I didn't catch him. Of course, he has a green card. Unfortunate, once again, Wolfie Gohan draws one, so it makes sense. Hopefully, no rush here. Considering I've probably done more, and I don't have a rush. Considering this game doesn't make any fucking sense. Doesn't make sense. Cool. He just did a green. He actually might have another one, because that was an artificial one. That's oh, a blue. Okay. Yeah, Ultra Gogeta. I don't know why I didn't think of blue. This will kill me. He's done two combos. Less. <sighs> situation. What a situation. It's Poppus. Okay, good job. Great job, even. <clears throat> interesting, interesting. It's a lot of fucking damage. Another green. Awesome, awesome. All my buffs are cancelable, by the way. Let's get you out of the way. Hopefully we'll get a guess. Hopefully get him out of the way. This would be ideal. Awesome. We are neutral here with Ultra Gogeta. You can pop main, try to catch this G4. He won't kill me if he catches me, at least right now. Uh, maybe later on this combo he could, but right now he can't. Nice patience. And we just lost our neutral. Perfect timing. Perfect timing, man. <clears throat> Live that. Cancel your buffs. What are you doing? Okay, goodbye to you. Just gonna throw a blue card. I had to vanish. What do I do? Just throw a blue card, get some damage on him. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, or sidestep, whatever. I mean, I would hope he's gonna have enough. He's gonna get his vanish back on these strikes, isn't he? He has all strikes in hand. Have to. I have to try it there at least. He has all strikes in hand. It's like I can't just let him have it. Sidestep. No, you went too late. Tough match there. Did not expect to get rushed as quick as we did, but. At least we can uh, manage to pull it out with Ultra Gogeta carrying G4. Um, well, <laughs> G4 tried and Super Vegito. He did all right.
He did. That was probably one of the better matches for him, even though he didn't do too much. I guess the support he offered, once again, is his best attribute for him that he is giving. I don't know. It just seems like strong units. I have no idea what this team is. Okay, let's see what happens. The running away team. Understood. Let's go for this blue card. Gonna do no damage because we have no build up. Eh, did okay. Considering this team has no synergy. I would hope so. Okay. I expected taps. I guess I didn't get any. <laughs> yeah, this team has no synergy. I'm doing a lot of damage just without anything going on, right? No synergy swap here. Go for this. Could probably swap. It's whatever. He has no cards in hand. I'll just go for a tackle then rush. Because he has no cards in hand. Oh, okay. So go for the rush. Uh green card's pretty obvious, but it is what it is. Again, this team is just no synergy. Just whatever team. I'm I'm really not sure what's going on with it. I think there's like a Zenkai buff somewhere or something like that. I saw Vegito Blue, I think. Ah, I, I don't know what's going on, right? But it is a team we're up against. Can't make Super Gito look good if Super Gito actually gets to come into a match. But again, you look at his color. Even Gogeta Blue can be scary to Super Gito. It's like <laughs> it's just the spot. It's just the spot he's in, man. Unfortunate. Okay. Dropped. Okay. Don't know if that was an intentional drop, but sure, I'll take the kill. <laughs> we kill, all right? <laughs> I shouldn't downplay him that much, but like. Sometimes I do get worried about his kills. Hello? Okay. Got the LF, which is nice. His LF is definitely beautiful as well. He has a few things. Um, cool looking LF. Nice support, given I wish his support were just damage, not support, because don't want my damage dealers supporting. I don't care about their support. I want damage. But um, he also has a good innate cargo speed. It's just, it would work so much better if that support wasn't support. And it was just, okay. More 20% damage inflicted per card, per card, per card, and it was just general damage inflicted per card drawn, whatever card it was. But no, he has support instead. Let's keep going. LOE! Uh, well, yellow, yellow, green, right? So Super Judo is definitely eating here. Again, yellows are everywhere! 1.9 million HP, what is this, like a 3 star? Jeez. Very low stars, clearly. I'll just be safe and do this. Full power! Oh, you. That'd be Zenkai. Oh, well, that's bad. Well, it's not bad. It's just not great. Cool. Tap out. Awesome. Hopefully we don't swap here, but if you do, yeah, it is what it is. Okay, swap out. Mm -hmm. I feel like he'll swap here. Yeah, okay, get a free card at least. Sweet. Dragon Balls, man. Holy shit. I just noticed how... Look at this shit. <laughs> my god, my Dragon Balls, bro. They don't exist. Can you swap? I feel like you could barely swap or barely not. Hopefully it's barely not. It's barely not. Gaming. Kill one uh, yellow here. Have Super Ajudo at least be able to breathe a little bit because this Zenkai Full Power Freeze is definitely not a damage dealer. Interesting green card there. Alright. Well, Super Ajudo, let's see it. I am curious how you could do to a yellow that has only 10% cut here. You won't kill. I don't expect you to kill on this. I'm not, you know, expecting god tierness from you, even though you're, you know, a unit that was E tier for a little bit there. Definitely not anymore. Okay. It's about what I expected. To be real, that is what I expected. Maybe a little bit more, but like, in a premise, that's basically it. Do you have a rush? Honestly, I figured he had a rush there because he's done a lot of cards here. Let's tap. Another card? I think I have another card. Yeah, yeah, there's the rush, yeah. <laughs> oh, LOE! How I will do 97 combos and not have a rush, but you will do two and have a rush. The premise of annoyance, to be real. Cool. Kill my G4. Nice, nice. He has no vanish. He has vanish? Am I trolling? That's still... A lot of interesting things going on here. A lot of interesting things.
Thank you. Now I could just make this simple and go to Ultra Gogeta, but no. Super Gogeta, I want to see. So show me something. I'm enthralled by that. Took quite a bit of hits there. Had a new hand. I can't. I can't vouch for him. Can't. All I can vouch for is his support. That's it. And his support. Because it's helping everyone else that's already at a high damage inflicted. I can't vouch for him. There's no shot. Oh look. That's a three star green. Like. I fucking hope he does okay damage to him. If not kill him on one card. Can't vouch. This is whatever. I, I don't really care. <laughs> Unless you have a second rush. Which, you know what? It's definitely possible with Legends. Hey, Pop Man. Keep going, 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 keep going. Yep, yep, yep. Lost my neutral. Okay, let's get out. I know. No, it's just cover change. I know, I know, I know. Hey, look at all the health back. Cool and freezes. Definitely a Z tier unit. Unlocks. How do you just heal when I just did a car? It's my car. The fuck? Oh, I'm gonna get double rushed here. Oh, here we go. <laughs> here we go with some bullshit. This is just infinite combo, by the way. Look at this shit. Kill me? Probably. <laughs> That's funny. That's a funny unit. Let me let my blue unit take care of it, because my purple clearly couldn't live two combos from a green, so. Three-star green. That's a three-star green! My purple died in two combos. What do you want me to say? Like, really? How do I defend Super Vegito? It's so fucking upsetting to see how he went from there, because mono purple, to here, because not mono purple. GT, hey, you notice that every single match there's a damn yellow? It's almost like I said, every fucking match is a great yellow, and it's a decent, decent, Majib's definitely not great, but decent yellow. It's like, hey, what the fuck is Super Vegito gonna do here? Jack shit! Like every other time there's a yellow, which is every fucking match. It's like, his existence means nothing <laughs> to these matches just because how strong these units are. It's not to call him bad, it's just to say he's just, it's just in a terrible spot. This is a regen unit, he'll do more if I land a combo on him. It's a long... Can't land a combo if I can't fucking hit him. That's great. What does this do for you? Okay. I'm glad you have three, three blasts. Do you have a rush? No? Okay, awesome. Sidestep for me. Appreciate that. Die, Majub. It died. Now, we got some support. That was good. Super Vegito got hit. He gave support. That's great. But that's all he's doing. And my units don't need support. They don't. Like, it's just straight up, they don't. Let's throw this because he's going to swap anyways. Oh my god, he does more regen. By the way, buffs are cancelable, by the way. Ha 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 ha. Why are his buffs cancelable, by the way? Someone explain it to me! <sighs> cancelable buffs. Not 20, 22 cent guy. I can't, I can't understand it. If you could try to explain it to me, someone please do. Cancelable buffs on a 20, 22 zen kai. All! All! His buffs, basically. How the fuck? Do you expect that to age well in modern times of 170%, 140%, 110%, 120% inflicted entry? Oh, look. I could cancel your buffs. All your buffs. Where these 120, 140, 170, I can't cancel jack shit. Super Vegito. I'm just going to show it because people might even not, not even know that he gets all his buffs canceled. Almost all. Sorry, I know there's like two things he probably doesn't get canceled. What did he get cancelled? Oh, he doesn't get this cancelled. I'm so sorry. 30%, by the way. 40% gets cancelled. All his fucking damage gets cancelled. 
Oh look, what else gets cancelled here? Let's uh, oh, oh, his support gets cancelled for himself. All he maintains is 30%! His strike stat isn't even absurdly high. FSK is like a 296 on its blast! Super Judo is 288. 30. 30. Let me... Uh, 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 I know, I'm stuttering to fuck. Let me see FSK's uncancelable damage. I, I am curious, okay. Um, oh, 299 blast, sorry. Even higher than I thought 298, I said. So that's cancelable. Cool, 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 cool. Um, okay, cannot be cancelled. Blah, blah, blah. What does he have here? Blast damage to regen. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, he has 30% as well. Oh. Shucks. It's also a good thing FSK has the best equipment in the entire game. That's a fucking base equipment. The hybrid Saiyan Awakened equipment, which is leagues better than the alright equipment. It's 8% pure to double attack. He has things to actually make him work. He has support around him for a team. <laughs> Obviously, I'm comparing the best Zenkai that ever existed. Obviously, not anymore, but Zenkai that was previously the best. FSK, Super Vegito. Because Super Vegito should have been this level, maybe not as broken as FSK, sure, because that was fucking annoying. But, like, dude, dude, it's like, you can't, you can't do it like this, you can't. <laughs> you can't fucking do 30% damage inflicted with lower stats than FSK than expect. Oh, look, this guy's gonna age great. He's not. He's not aging well at all. It's already been like two months and he's not even core on his team. He's core mono purple. You know how he's core mono purple? Because not enough purple Saiyans that are good enough. Like. <laughs> Just run GB, you run Super Vegito, and then you run Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Any other purple that's a Saiyan comes out. Like a fucking purple IT Goku. I don't fucking know. It just replaced Super Vegito. You replace Super Vegito. You replace either or. But you keep GV. It's like... He's so easily replaceable already. It's so sad. Android's here. Cell. God, Cell's gonna fuck me up. Hey, look. Another damn yellow. Can you tell me yellow dominant? Oh, he doesn't have a... Red slot in that last slot. Let me just throw this for safety precautions. Okay, 2.9. It's not even that much. Swap out for you. Okay, let's try to win this clash. Win that? Okay. Uh, can't go anywhere. Like, Cell's not cover changing. You could go to 21, I guess. But, like, okay. Super Judo will draw a card on entry here. We'll do negative 2 damage, though. Oh, nice. He actually did more than negative 2. Surprise. I'm real. I'm genuinely surprised. By the way, I'm not even trolling on that. Oh, my phone's overheating. Hello. See you lagging. I think it's good now. I think. I hope. I don't want it to do that. So please don't do that. Let's get out of there. Just blast here. Oh, that's not good. We have our big cut still, but still not great because probably has a rush. Considering it's been uh, two combos. Why? Huh? Are you trying to farm a rush? Definitely trying to farm a rush, huh? No. A lot. You had advantage. On everything. It's fine with me. That was definitely unique as well. Don't know what's really going on here. Okay, sure. Whatever is happening is happening. Not really in agreement with it, but sure. Uh, swap here. No. Swap here. You're going to sack off for a 21 anyways. Oh, I'm not going to sack off anybody. We do more to regen, by the way. Had to drop there, because that would not kill. I promise you on everything on my life, that ultimate would not kill if I just threw it mid-combo. On top of, could have just covered out. Oh, imagine it didn't kill it. How much did it do? It did 2.2. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Finally, I could say that's not bad for Super Judo Wings. It's more against the regen unit, right? Well, tap here. Last time he PV'd it, so he's probably going to banish this one. Yeah. Pretty obvious, because last time again, it worked out. So why would you not go for it again? Because it probably will work out again, but no. Anticipated that. Got it out of the way. Please don't guess me. Gaming. That was a very strange rush to the other time. He didn't even, like, stop time event to, like, try to catch me. Just threw it. Because I guess he thought tap arts would be a blast arts, but... Why would I blast arts when I even rush? Like, you know. Play a little safe there at that point. Okay. Well, there's my strike. Well, sidestep. I was hoping for a second one, but it's alright. Let's just swap. Cool. Let's go. 
keep doing that every single time. Every single time you just go for a PV on that. You don't even try to like, you know, play around it. And it works out, all right? Can he kill? I know it's a yellow. It's not a great yellow. It's okay yellow. It's a super Vito. Who is purple? It is what it is. It is what it is. I, I I've shown enough to where I I know you know you can see the power creep on him already. Just a lot of things. Just held back. He's definitely held back to uh to an extent I am not happy with because he did not deserve to be held back on. Uh, he did not. He he deserved to be what FSK was near, if not on the level, goddamn close. Like really, he did deserve that, but. Here he is, not even core, on his main team of fusions. Like, what else can I say? This is a straight-up fact. He is not core on his main team. There is nothing else I could say that's like, okay, but he's still good in it. Like, he's not core. There's a yellow every fucking match. Like, it is what it is. Let's just do one more, then wrap it up. Last matchup against USS. High stars. Great. Let's see it. Cool. Great starting hand to have a blue card. Same here, man. Call you out. Let's see how little. Okay. Firstly, that's Golden Freeze. That's fucking green. He is neutral. There's a lot. That was actually impressive. That was fairly impressive, Super Vegito. Wow. Fuck. It's still fairly impressive, though, what he did there. Okay. You gonna stay in? I don't know what this says. Is that confident about Golden Freezer, or is Super Geo just that lacking that he's like, alright, fuck it. You done? I'm gonna do it. Okay. Cancel my buffs. Draw a green card, a blue card rather. You have a rush? And we have a lot of support for my team, so that's cool, I guess. Let's tap here. Tap again. Okay. Can I just one-shot you? I have a million fucking percent support at this point. I, I, he did cancel some with the green card, but I've done a lot of cards as well. I canceled damn buffs. Please kill. Thank you. Uh, genuinely, thank you. Because that kind of made me think you went in, because I'm not going to lie. Um, I always did it, too. I didn't see. That was probably the one time I actually should have looked. Thank God, though, Super Judo kills a green unit, right? Like... Be a little scared if he didn't, to be real, but fine here. I might just try to catch him with this on uh, G4. I wouldn't even kill anyways, whatever. Pulled him, but it's not going to kill. It's like, you know, whatever. Let's tap here. I thought he vanished. Okay. <laughs> always, always another way to live. These dumb units. No, I'm the dumb one. Thank God. <laughs> Nullify endurance, anyways. Please taps. Thank God. <laughs> Golden Frieza. He stayed in against the purple. I don't know what the play was there, but hey, maybe he thought Super Joe was that bad. He's not that bad. He's not terrible, even. It's just <laughs> fucking power creep on him. But one nice thing of Super Judo overall, again, he's not on his main team. If you're not core on your main team, you definitely have gotten power creep at that point. Uh, G4. USG, then you just leader slot somebody else, and I know I could just say that like, okay, um, you just leader, leader slot somebody else on like Androids. Like, if you don't want to run MVP 17, or turn power 17, you run Ultra Kyle Ken. Like, that's a different scenario, because with Super Vegito, this is a new fucking Zenkai. Turn power 17 is about a year old almost. You get what I mean? So, if you're getting replaced leader slot wise by unit, and yes, I know Ultra Kyle Ken's better than Super Vegito, like, no shit. But Future Gohan, Full Power Frieza, Maju, like, all these other yellows that probably a better spot Super Vegito is a problem. Like, Majub should not be a better unit than Super Vegito on this. Full Power Frieza should not be a better unit on this team than Super Vegito. It's just not a thing that should exist, but it does. Let me know what I think of Super Vegito, and I'll see you guys in the next one.